It's the world's largest outdoor American saddlebred show, and it's right here in the heart of the bluegrass. And it's been around a while. Lee Cruz joins us from the Kentucky Horse Park, where the Junior League of Lexington's Charity Horse Show is taking place. the click. So here's the thing. We're at the Kentucky Horse Park. This is the Rolex Outdoor Stadium and the brand new home for the Junior League of Lexington's Horse Show, which of course is really the triple crown of uh, the industry. Good to see you ladies. How Thanks are you? Here. One of the legs of the triple crown. Anyway, this is Emily and Katie. They're with me representing the uh, Junior League. The new home has worked out so far how well? What are we talking about? Oh, it's been wonderful. Um, we are getting rave reviews from riders and trainers. Um, the arena itself looks amazing. The horses have been performing really well on this footing, um, and we're just happy to be out here at the horse park. What do uh, patrons need to know? If they want to come out tonight or throughout the weekend, what should they know? They should know that the weather has been beautiful, and it's been a really, a really good place to come for families. Um, tonight is military and first responders. We're giving free admission, and we're honoring them. Tomorrow we're honoring breast cancer survivors, and so we're encouraging people to wear pink. And Saturday at 12, we have our dog show that we do every year. And again, if I want tickets, I can get them at the gate, I assume? Yes, you can get them at the gate. It's $5 for general admission on the weeknights and $10 on weekends. For those in the, uh, familiar with the Saddlebred uh, grouping, they know that this is an important stop. This is, uh, it, like we described, it's the triple crown. It's one of the legs of yeah. that triple crown before they move on. I forgot where it is, like Kansas City and Louisville, I think, are the other two stops. Right? Yes, um, it's the first leg of the Saddlebred Triple Crown, and it's also the world's largest outdoor saddlebred show. And in moving to the horse park and staying in the Rolex Stadium, we've remained the world's largest outdoor show. What kind of events will they see tonight? Do you guys know? Um, the classes are going to be varied. Katie, do you know some of the highlighted classes? I like tonight? the way she's throwing you under the bus right now. That was a slick <laughs> move by Emily. So here we go. This is for the Buick. We do you know what it is? Tonight we have some of the Hackney Pony classes as well as some of the five gated and three gated horse classes and fine harness classes where How they'll drive that? some ponies. How about that girl right there? She, <laughs> she knew her stuff. Emily, it didn't, it didn't work. So again, you can get your tickets here. It's in this brand new venue, which is great because I was walking around and man, there's more opportunities to buy things. We've got shops behind the seats, right? Absolutely. We have about 25 vendors here with stuff from all over, about 950 horses, um, representing, I think, 39 states and seven different countries. Um, and we're just doing really well out here. Yeah, great food, great drink. There's a bar right there, ladies. I don't know if there's a guy. I'm going to go talk to him in a minute. Uh, again, it's the uh, Junior League of Lexington's Horse Show, which, of course, is now in its new home here at the Kentucky Horse Park at the Rolex Outdoor Stadium. We'll send it back to you guys. Oh, looks like fun. Looks hot, yeah. though. Y'all stay cool. You may need to hit up that bar. Yeah, maybe so. Mm -hmm.